Nadja Jan visits this drugs rehabilitation clinic in Kabul in secret. She says the UN-funded Nejat centers helped her overcome her heroin addiction. Now she smokes opium instead. My husband was addicted to drugs in Iran. When he returned to Afghanistan, he smoked in the room in front of us and my children and I became addicted. We had to use drugs or our bodies would hurt and only drugs could reduce the pain. Afghanistan's government reckons the nation has about a million opium and heroin users. How many are women is difficult to establish. Officials at the Nejat Center believe there are about 60,000 female users of illegal drugs, including marijuana. In a nation where women often need male permission to leave the home, getting help for drug addiction is a serious problem. During the internal conflicts in Afghanistan, we had economic problems and we were induced into using opium by our neighbors to help Help reduce the suffering and pain of war. That's why we're addicted to opium. Nijat Senza project manager Mohammed Amen Rafi says migrant workers and refugees returning from Iran and Pakistan after decades of conflicts are behind the rise in female drug users. <laughs> We're trying to reduce the use of drugs, but we don't have enough facilities. And we've noticed that the number of drug users is increasing day by day because some Afghan migrants who return from Iran are addicted to drugs. Iran has the second highest rate of heroin abuse on the planet behind Afghanistan, which produces all but a tenth of the world's opium.